was sunny. And then, look at this. Straight storm rolls in. This is Miami. But this is life, motherfucker. It'll be sunny as fuck. Life will be great. And then adversity strikes. Are you ready, bitch? A lot of motherfuckers don't get that the man you are, when shit ain't going your way, that's who the fuck you are. That's why I teach people to face adversity daily that's self-inflicted so that when unavoidable situations, unavoidable life circumstances, adversity comes and I hit them right in their fucking face like an unforeseen storm, they're ready. You guys, you're not who you think you are when everything's going your way. You're who you are when the bottom falls out. The way you act when you lose everything, that's your level of growth. That's your level of strength. I've shown mine time and time again. And I've worked with a lot of people. And the second they're not getting their way, they buckle like broads. That's what we don't do here. That's why I know that the whole thing that matters is who you are when the fucking storm rolls in, bitch. But on another note, stop saying you're going to be up here with me. Stop saying you'll be rich one day. Don't even fucking tell me that you're going to have a Bugatti one day. You're going to be in Miami balling one day. Don't even tell me that. Because I don't give a fuck about that. Show me your habits and I'll tell you your future. How about you show me your habits and then I'll tell you you'll surpass me, motherfucker. If you show me the habits that surpass mine, you'll surpass me. This is the guarantee I give you. These are the chills. This is confirmation. When you get these on your arm, this is God telling you you're correct. Understand that. You guys, the only way you'll ever beat me is if your habits perceive me, proceed me. If your habits are better than mine, they proceed mine, then you'll beat me. You won't beat me by a fluke. Because someone who gets it will easily lose it if their habits aren't aligned with keeping it. You see what I'm saying? I just want you guys all to know that it doesn't matter how far you make it. It just matters how well you could stare yourself in the mirror and be proud of the man looking back at you. I don't have to win anymore. I've done a lot of winning. I've left a legacy. I'm a fucking legend. I don't give a fuck what you want to speak about, this, that, the other. I will die a legend. And that's the facts. I've done it. But I don't care. I want to be closer to you guys. I want to guide you guys better. I don't want to go on vacation. I don't want to travel to Europe. I don't want to do all these things that rich people want to do. I don't need to do it all. I could be happy with living around Miami and just blessing motherfuckers with the habits and changing lives. I don't even need to do anything more than I've done. But if God blesses me with more than I have, I'll run it up. If, I, if everything's taken from me, I'll run it up. And I'm talking about running up those daily habits that heighten my frequency, that bring me to a, bring me to a level of understanding that... We all already made it when we can look ourselves in the mirror and say we're proud without one lie about who we are. No, I've created the man that I would listen to. I've created the man that I always needed. I sure wish I had me growing up. These are the things you should be saying in the mirror. Look at me. I would listen to me. And if you can't say that, keep working till you would. I don't even like where I'm at. That's the thing that sucks. I'm just further than everybody else. There's nobody else. There's nobody else that precedes me. Nobody. In certain areas, they definitely do. But in character as a whole, what they've done, the only people that beat me are my guys. I would listen to Yados. I would listen to Gas Money. I would listen to, I would listen to my boy Sohab. They're younger much younger, they learn from me. And I'm not biased towards it. You motherfuckers are flawed. And the second you listen, you'll beat all of us. 
You motherfuckers who are killing it in other areas that just smash us, if you listen to me and you alter your daily habits, you will take it to a level that you never thought fathomable. You will be at such a level of understanding, a level of connection to life, a level of depth, a level of spiritual awareness that nothing could stop you. You guys have these areas, these zones of genius that are fucking crazy, but you don't have what I have. You didn't hold your word to yourself without fail for a decade plus. That's what makes a man different. It is the rarest thing on the planet that a man decided through conscious endeavor to elevate himself and who he is above all other men by choice. Everything that was under his control. He said, not again, not failing there again. And he chose not to. To where when he looked around in the world, nobody outranked him. Nobody. And then guess what happened? Success came as a byproduct of what, who he became. What he had created and cultivated internally became his external world. I love you guys more than you can fathom. I'll never turn my back on you guys. I know if you come find me, I have the answers. You may not like them. They may hurt your little fucking heart. They may bruise your little soul. But that's what the truth does, motherfucker. It'll set you fucking free less. Go!